All right, we're getting the metal hot. This is the blow off for the hot water heater. All right, we're gonna check and see. No, not quite. All right, there you have it. Okay, we're gonna cut this PEX piping. Right, now we're going to connect it to this male nipple. All right, which in, we're going to solder it to about at this point right here. All right, now we're gonna connect this PEX pipe. All right, now the nipple, as you see, it will not fit. It does not go in, all right? Now we're gonna put this expansion ring on here. Okay, now we're going to expand it with this up nor. M12, all right, and this is how it works. Okay, so it spreads it open, you shove it down, you spread it open again, and then you put on the nipple. Okay, here we go. Now, this slowly closes up. All right. Now, get this all the way down. And here in just a minute, it will close. It's slowly closing now. All right. And look. And I'm pulling. So it closes up within seconds. Immediately it starts to reclose. All right, so I am pulling This is on there And that's how that works All right Now I'm gonna have to take my hose because I just connected it to this And I have to split my hose all the way down I have to split this Hose, I'll show you. All right. I'm going to have to take a drywall knife and split this right down the middle and then put it over my PEX tubing because you don't want to, this is not designed to go straight into the ground. Not this stuff. It is not. All right, it'll become brittle. You want to keep it out of the sunlight. It can become brittle over time. So you want to protect it from the sunlight. Okay, so we will be soldering this and getting it finished up. This is part three of water blasting. Okay, here's the drainage. It's now complete. You can hear the water running. That's your hot water heater blow off valve. Okay. Goes down and through the wall. Hot water heater drainage. Okay. There's the drain pipe. All right, and it goes around and then out. Okay. It's coming under the porch. Remember the channel that was here, part one and two. There it is all filled in again. All right. So there you have it. Okay, complete. I think I do this. Good. Yeah, not like it. Yeah. Oh!
This is Ken with Home Improvement Tips, aka Easy 2 Tips and Tricks. All right, I was calling this the water blaster. This is actually going under the concrete porch for the drainage from the hot water heater. All right, the hot water heater has a blow off valve from if pressure gets too, too much, it balances everything out that has to drain. All right, so I just completed the drainage out here. How to go under your concrete, how to get a pipe under your concrete porch or driveway. Okay, so this is part three. I'll be doing a continuation of this. So tell a friend, it's a win, 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 like, share, have it subscribe, subscribe. Save this video for a future reference. You may find it beneficial. I'll share it with a friend. So thank you for watching. Thank you for your time. Out of all the channels there are to go to, you could be anywhere, but you're here. So thank you. I look forward to hearing from you. And as always, if you ever have any questions, feel free to ask. And never give up. As you see it on my channel, because there's always a way. Always. Bye for now and God bless. Check out and see and watch what the water blaster can do. You can dig without a shovel. Okay?